to do visual project that is data handling maths project to do visual work project we need a chart paper crayons and pencil some stickers and tissue paper first we need to do cover page and fill it with any color of the crayon and leave space to write your name and some details after that wrap it with tissue paper for a soft look and take glitter crayon glitter silver crayon for extra effects next let's move on to the project information is often represented visually by organizing extending and understanding we can do visual work on any topic today i'm doing with maths graph and chart are the visual representation of data they enable us to see the main features of the data first we should collect the raw data i have collected the information by my classmates there are 120 students in my class each of them selected their favorite food one student said his favorite fruit is orange another student said that his favorite fruit is cherry like that i have collected and counted them this is the information first we have to collect the raw data which is not organized see for example orange fruit like by 40 students banana 30 students pineapple 25 students watermelon 20 students cherry 5 students with this raw data we can organize in three types tick tally marks pictograph and bar graph first let's start with tally marks tally marks are just straight lines they are used to keep track of something say we have five toys to count we'll draw one line for one toy every fifth line is drawn across the previous four lines so we can easily see groups of five tally charts are useful to record the data quickly tally means we should tally the raw data for example let's take cherry cherry is liked by five students one line represents one student so we should draw four lines and one slant line that makes a set of five like that we should do for the rest of the fruits watermelon 20 so four sets pineapple 25 so five sets banana 30 so six sets orange 40 so there are eight sets here is the title favorite fruit of class 3 students here is the key one represents one student to understand any chart title and key are very important next is pictograph by pictograph we understand that raw data is represented in pictures i have used star one star represents five students cherry there is one star that indicates five students like that only in the rest all next is bar graph in this we should represent the data in x and y axis in the form of bars in x axis we are representing the fruits in y axis we are representing the number of students for example cherry 5 students watermelon 20 students and so on the special thing of bar graph is we can easily identify which is the fruit liked by more number of students. 
that is orange with 40 students. Till now we learned how to do data handling. Let's summarize once. First we should collect the raw data and then we should do it in tally marks. After that pictograph and finally bar graph. With this we will conclude. Visual representation helps us to understand data quickly.